Welcome. So what I have here is the arc cosine of one half. And what I want to do is show you how to evaluate for the inverse, tan or inverse cosine function. So in evaluating for the inverse cosine function, it's very important that we uh, make sure we determine what the range and really understand what exactly we're tr we're, they're asking us to evaluate for. So what I like to do is I like to write it as a function saying cosine of theta is equal to 1 half. And that theta has to fall within the range of 0 and pi, meaning my angle has to fall between the range of uh, my first quadrant and my second quadrant. So what it's saying is the cosine of what angle equals 1 half? That's really what this is asking us. But then it has to fall within the range of 0 and pi. So I look at my angles. And remember, the cosine of an angle is equal to the x-coordinate of your coordinate point on the unit circle. So what coordinate, what x coordinate do I have that's equal to 1 half? So when I kind of follow a, along here, I see that my x coordinate is equal to my, um, or my, uh, my angle is equal to 1 half at the angle of pi over 3. Therefore, the angle cosine of pi over 3 is equal to 1 half. So therefore, the inverse cosine of 1 half is equal to pi over 3. Thanks.